Hey guys, I just wanted to make a quick video. Um, I was having an issue with my grammar police. I would go into the game and it would say I needed to download some Microsoft speech recognition thing or some sort. Um, I couldn't find a video on how to fix it. Um, it was kind of hard to find a video that someone actually solved the issue. So if you're having that problem where you try to click your keybind to say something to the dispatcher in LSPDFR, and nothing happens. Um, this is a good thing to do, just in case. Um, particularly for me at work, because I had a new Windows installation and I didn't have any Microsoft Speech downloaded, so the game or Grammar Police wouldn't work properly without the Speech Pack downloaded. So first thing you want to do, if you don't already have Grammar Police do downloaded, download it. Um, you should already have it downloaded. Um, and then I'll put this in the link. This is the first thing you need to download is the Microsoft speech or actually, sorry, you need to download the runtime first. Um, let me refresh it. So it'll show what you show when you first open it. Um, this is only for English. I don't know how to do anything else. So sorry if you're not English, um, you'll want to download the speech platform and you'll want to download the the bigger file. Um, don't download any of these. You just need this one and then hit download and it'll take you to the setup. And then after you've downloaded that, once again, this is for English, hit download and you'll want to scroll down. Um, or you can do it the easier way. You can search for English EN dash US and then scroll down. It's going to be the last one. So make sure you're downloading SR, the speech recognition model. Don't download the text-to-speech one. You want the speech, rec the speech recognition one, the 22.4 megabyte one, MSS speech SR, English US, blah, blah, blah. And then you'll download that and go through the setup. And this is what fixed mine, because most people only tell you to download the runtime. They don't tell you to download the actual language. Um, if you want to just double check, go to your language settings, Make sure it says English right here, and it has a speech icon next to it, and it'll say speech recognition installed. Um, you can close that after you do these two, and then if that still doesn't work, um, go to your files in your grand GTA 5 directory. Uh, you can go to plugins, uh, LSPDFR, Gamma Police. Um, if you modify any of this, I recommend copying it, pasting it, and then renaming it to custom.ini, or you don't have to put the ini because it's already a configuration file, but I do ini just in case. Um, I already have one, so I'm just going to delete that one that I just did. But once you make that custom file, go into it. Um, make sure it's english-us or en-us. Uh, enable speech recognition is set to true, not false. Um, for ease of access, I did numpad zero because it's just easier. It's more natural than pressing the alt key. It's kind of right next to the mouse if you're right-handed. Um, everything else should be good. Make sure hold to talk is true because that's kind of goofy if you have to press it, release and press it again to stop. Um, and that should be everything. Make sure you hit Control S to save, or up here, save if you edit anything. Um, if you have any com or questions, just comment them below. I'll try to help you the best I can. Um, and that should fix your grammar police if you're having speech issues. Just let me know in the comments if you have any questions. Thank you.